Hello everyone. Today's topic addresses a crucial question for anyone living with diabetes, can you eat fruits? The answer is not as straightforward as it might seem, so in this episode, we will take a close look at this issue. People with diabetes need to pay special attention to the types of carbohydrates they consume. Simple carbohydrates, which rapidly increase blood sugar levels, should be limited. These primarily include sugar and highly processed products such as sweets, cakes, and also bread with added sugars and sweeteners, instead of reaching for these products. Diabetics might consider sweeteners that are more favorable for their condition. Natural sweeteners like stevia, erythritol, or xylitol can be good alternatives, though their use should also be discussed with a doctor. Artificial sweeteners such as aspartame or acesulfame K are another option. But their health impact is subject to debates and research. Returning to fruits they are a source of vitamins, minerals, and fiber. But also contain natural sugars that can affect blood glucose levels. It's important to choose those with a low glycemic index and consume them in moderation. But which fruits are best for diabetics? How should they be selected, and how can they affect blood sugar regulation? I will try to answer these questions in the rest of this episode, stay tuned. Remember, the information in this video is for educational purposes only and does not replace medical advice. Let's start with the basics. Everyone with diabetes should be aware of the symptoms indicating a high blood sugar level. The most common of these include fatigue, increased thirst, frequent urination, blurred vision. Recognizing these signs is crucial for effective health management. According to the 1998 definition adopted by the Food and Agriculture Organization FAO, and the World Health Organization WHO, the glycemic index is a measure of the area under the blood glucose curve after consuming 50 grams of carbohydrates from a test meal, compared to the response from consuming the same amount of carbohydrates from a reference product, such as glucose or white bread. Studies have shown that foods with a high glycemic index quickly raise blood glucose levels, resulting in a rapid insulin surge and a sudden drop in blood glucose. This, in turn, leads to feelings of hunger and prompts the consumption of larger amounts of food. Considering the glycemic index, diabetics are advised to choose fruits with a GI value that does not exceed 50. This is crucial for controlling blood sugar levels and avoiding sudden spikes. Here is a list of fruits that can be safely consumed by people with diabetes. Please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. It will really help us grow, especially since this is our new project. Thanks. Now, let's get to the topic. Let's discover safe choices for diabetics. Avocado, glycemic index 10. Avocado has one of the lowest glycemic indices among fruits, making it an excellent choice for diabetics. This creamy fruit is not only low in carbohydrates, which helps prevent rapid spikes in blood sugar levels, but it's also high in healthy fats and fiber. These fats help to slow the absorption of other carbohydrates consumed in the same meal, thereby stabilizing blood sugar levels and providing sustained energy. Additionally, the high fiber content in avocados aids in digestion and can further help to maintain a steady blood glucose level, making avocados a highly beneficial food for those managing diabetes. Gooseberries, with a glycemic index of 15, are an excellent choice for people with diabetes due to their low capacity to raise blood sugar levels. Consuming them does not lead to rapid spikes in glucose, which is crucial for managing diabetes. Additionally, gooseberries are a source of fiber, which stabilizes blood sugar levels, supports satiety, and helps control appetite. They are also rich in vitamin C, which strengthens the immune system and acts as an antioxidant and contain other important nutrients such as vitamin K and manganese. Gooseberries are a great choice for snacks or as an addition to salads. Combining health benefits with enjoyable taste. Cherries, with a glycemic index of 22, are an excellent choice for people with diabetes because their sugars are released slowly, preventing sudden spikes in glucose. They are rich in anthocyanins, which have anti-inflammatory and antioxidant properties that may reduce the risk of heart disease and certain types of cancer. Cherries also provide vitamin C, vitamin A, potassium, and fiber, supporting the immune system, blood pressure regulation, and proper digestive system function. They can be consumed raw, added to salads, desserts, or used to make healthy preserves. Apples, with a glycemic index of 34, are a good choice for people with diabetes due to their moderate impact on blood sugar levels. 
They are rich in fiber, especially in the peel, which helps control glucose. Apples also provide vitamin C and potassium, supporting the immune system and heart health. Available in various varieties, they can be consumed raw, added to desserts or salads, making them a versatile component of a healthy diet. Raspberries, with a glycemic index of 25, are an excellent choice for people with diabetes because they help stabilize blood sugar levels due to their low sugar content and high fiber content. They are rich in vitamin C and manganese, supporting skin health, the immune system, and bone health, and also have anti-inflammatory properties. Raspberries can be added to yogurts, cereals, fruit salads, or desserts, making them a versatile and healthy addition to the diet. Grapefruit, blackberries, tangerines, and peaches all have a glycemic index of 25, making them excellent options for people with diabetes, helping to stabilize blood sugar levels. These fruits are not only low in glycemic index but also offer a range of health benefits. Grapefruit is a well-known source of vitamin C, which strengthens the immune system, and contains lycopene, an antioxidant that may help prevent certain types of cancer. Grapefruit can also support heart health by lowering cholesterol levels. Blackberries are rich in vitamins C and K, and also provide fiber, which helps control blood sugar levels. With their antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties, blackberries can contribute to overall health improvement and protection against chronic diseases. Tangerines, like other citrus fruits, are an excellent source of vitamin C, crucial for immunity and skin health. They are also rich in fiber and contain flavonoids, which have anti-inflammatory properties and may protect against heart diseases. Peaches provide a range of vitamins and minerals, including vitamins A, C, E, and potassium. Their fiber content helps regulate blood sugar levels, and antioxidants support cell protection from damage. Currants, with a glycemic index of 25, are an excellent choice for diabetics due to their low effect on blood sugar levels. They are rich in vitamin C, which strengthens immunity and protects cells, and fiber, which stabilizes glucose levels and supports digestion. They also contain iron, which supports the production of blood cells, and potassium, which regulates blood pressure. Currants can be eaten raw, added to yogurt or desserts, making them a versatile addition to your diet. Strawberries, with a glycemic index of 40, are a good choice for people with diabetes as they have a moderate impact on blood sugar levels. They are rich in vitamin C, which strengthens the immune system and supports skin health. And potassium, important for nerve function and blood pressure regulation. Strawberries also provide fiber, which helps regulate glucose and lower cholesterol levels. Additionally, they contain anthocyanins, which have anti-inflammatory properties and support heart health. They can be consumed in various ways, from fresh fruits to additions in desserts and smoothies. Blueberries, with a glycemic index of 50, are rich in anthocyanins which have antioxidant properties, support heart health, and reduce inflammation. They are also a source of vitamins C and K, and manganese, which contribute to improved skin health, immune system, and metabolism. Thanks to their high fiber content, blueberries help regulate blood sugar levels and maintain a feeling of fullness, which is beneficial for weight management. They can be added to cereals, yogurts, smoothies, or consumed as a healthy snack. Berries, with a glycemic index of 45, are a good choice for people with diabetes due to their moderate impact on blood sugar levels. They are a source of vitamin C, which supports the immune system and skin, and fiber, which stabilizes blood sugar levels and aids digestion. Berries also provide B vitamins and anthocyanins, which have anti-inflammatory properties and positively affect heart and brain health. They can be added to cereals, smoothies, or consumed as a snack. The value of the glycemic index of fruits is influenced by their ripeness. Less ripe fruits have a lower GI than more ripe ones. The glycemic index is also influenced by thermal processing of products and the degree of their fragmentation. Processed and crushed products have a higher glycemic index than raw ones. So let's avoid fruits with a high index such as mango, 51, banana, 52, melon, 65, dried dates, 70, or watermelons, 72, and and let's enjoy well-being every day. In addition to diet, there are natural ways to help control diabetes. Regular physical activity, adequate water, sleep and stress management are key elements. Additionally, some herbs and supplements may help regulate blood sugar levels, such as cinnamon and aloe. 
I hope that today's episode provided you with valuable information about what fruits can be safely included in a diabetic's diet. If so, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss more tips on a healthy lifestyle. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode.